Hi, welcome to the Center Maths Problem of the Week. For this week's problem, we have a second order non-homogeneous differential equation. Y double prime plus 3Y prime equals 18X minus 36 plus 72E to the 3X. And we want to find the general solution. So the general solution can be written as Y equals Y sub C plus Y sub P, where Y sub C is the complementary solution and y sub p is the particular solution. First, we're going to find the complementary solution. You find the complementary solution by solving the associated homogeneous equation. So you set y double prime plus 3y prime equal to 0. And then you can find the characteristic equation, r squared plus 3r equals 0. When you factor out an r, you get r equals r times r plus 3 equals equal to 0, which from that equation you find the roots are negative 3 and 0. This equation has two real distinct roots. And since it has two, distinct, two real distinct roots, the complementary equation, the complementary solution is written as y sub c is equal to c sub 1 times e to the r sub 1 x plus c sub 2 times e to the r, r sub 2 x, where c sub 1 and c sub 2 are constants and r sub 1 and r sub 2 are the two roots. And when we plug in when r sub 1 and r sub 2, we plug in negative 3 and 0 into this equation to get our complementary solution. And now we want to find the particular solution. We use the method of undetermined coefficients to make an educated guess for what form the particular solution is going to take. Since we have 18x minus 36 plus 72e to the 3x, we have a polynomial and some multiple of e to the 3x. Um, so our, our guess is y sub p is equal to ax squared plus bx plus ce to the 3x. ax squared plus bx accounts for the polynomial 18x minus 36. And ce to the 3x accounts for 72e to the 3x. Now we're going to take the first derivative and the second derivative of the particular solution, and we'll substitute the first derivative into y prime, and we'll substitute the second derivative into y double prime. Our first derivative of the particular solution is 2ax plus b plus 3ce to the 3x. And then our second derivative is 2a plus 9ce to the 3x. And once we substitute these into our original equation, we get 2a plus 9ce to the 3x plus 3 times the quantity of 2ax plus b plus 3ce to the 3x which is all equal to 18x minus 36 plus 72e to the 3x. And then down here we combined like terms. Now we want to find the coefficients a, b, and c. And we're going to equate the coefficients of like terms on each side. Um, for example, we have 6ax on this side and we have 18x here. We have 6a equals 18. 2a plus 3b, and then negative 36. And then we have 18c e to the 3x, and we have 72e to the 3x. Therefore, 18c is equal to 72. Now we can just solve for a, b, and c. Divide 6 by both sides to get 
a equals 3, divide 18 by both sides to get c equals 4, and then if you plug in 3 for a, you can solve for b, which is negative 14. Now that we have our coefficients, we can go back and plug a, b, and c in, into our particular solution. We have our complementary solution and we have our particular solution and then we add them together for our general solution. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to check out our blog, check out centerofmath.org, and follow us on Twitter and Facebook. Thank you.